Ladies and gentlemen, right now as the lights come down, courtesy of the Knights of Exarban Foundation, we have what we call the Wild Ride of the Night. A cowboy or cowgirl has the opportunity to win a $100 gas card. And tonight, take a look at the in-house big screen because here comes your wild ride. The gate opens up on Chandler Bounds. And then sudden, Rodeo Company's crank that. Branded 68 says, you've made the eight seconds. Now it's my turn. The cowboy goes for his wrap. He hits the ground, and then the pressure's on. Your head's on fire. Your tail's a kitchen. And that is your $100 Knots of Exarbin Foundation Wild Ride of the Night. Ladies and gentlemen, earlier tonight, we had the honor of meeting the commander of the United States Strategic Command General, Bob Keller. We as American adults know how to look up to a man and his group of component commanders as we do. But I'd like you to think about how would you see this through the eyes of a child, a Cub Scout? The Cub Scout oath is on my honor. I will do my best to do my duty to God and my country and to obey the Scout law, to help other people at all times and to keep myself physically strong mentally awake and morally straight. They're the little guys getting their first lesson how to strike a flint and build a fire. As age will come upon them, they can be a Boy Scout. They grow in honor, duty to God and country, duty to other people, and duty to self. But ladies and gentlemen, as that spotlight broadens. I want you to look at the older Boy Scouts teaching. It is an honor and a duty to salute the flag of the United States of America. God bless the Cub and Boy Scouts. Nobody loves their freedom more than a cowboy. And nobody respects the men and women of the armed forces more than a cowboy. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we recall on those who have answered the call of trouble. Stayed until it's over over there. And for those who have paid the supreme sacrifice to perpetuate our brand of liberty. For those that wear the stars and stripes, domestic and abroad, we salute you. And as the cowboy rides away, he says, I may never turn my back on this country or the flag that represents 300 million Americans strong or the greatest warrior of France in the world and other than the best And to the greatest rodeo talent on planet Earth here today, we Tonight, Exarban's River City Rodeo and Stock Show hosts the annual Buckaroo Bash fundraiser every year in August. 
Benefits, Justin Cowboy Crisis, the Omaha Mounted Patrol, and helps send disadvantaged youth to the rodeo. This evening, a check in the amount of $5,000 is being presented to the Justin Cowboy Crisis Fund, represented by Cindy Schoenholtz. Another check in the amount of $5,000 is being presented to Sergeant Mitchell and the members of the Omaha Mounted Patrol. It will be used to purchase tack. Presented by the members of the Xarbin Rodeo Committee. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for those that bring the rodeo to the River City Roundup and Stock Show. And now, as we close out this evening's festivities, it's time for a weather report from Channel 6 WOWT. Good evening, rodeo fans. I'm meteorologist Rusty Lord from WWT Channel 6, the Weather Authority. Started off the evening on a very, very nice note, but by the time you make your way out from the, well, as soon as the rodeo's over, we'll be near 52 degrees at 10 o'clock. Tomorrow morning, starting out near 42 and 43 by 8 o'clock as you're getting your day going. For all the latest news, weather, and traffic information, watch Daybreak live on Channel 6 from 4.30 to 7 a.m. We will see you at the autograph session, Mutual of Omaha display across the street at the Hilton for the Jack Daniels after party stop and the buckle presentation. On your way out tonight, be careful, be courteous, and be cautious. Tomorrow night, Bob Tallman and Roger Mooney want to talk to you, not about you. Good night, everybody.